where a very warm welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to talk about watering. In this video, you will learn how to properly water your plants and learn the mistakes that you or me might have made. If you haven't made the mistakes, it's also good to know to prevent them later. Number one, the most common mistakes is, is watering at the wrong time of the day. If you water at the noon, the plants won't be using the water because most of the water will evaporate, wasting it. So water when the sun is still high up in the sky so the plant can absorb all the water. All the water, I mean. For example, you can wake up at 6 a.m., drink some plants, and start your day by watering your plants. Number two, not knowing when your plants need water. A common problem is that watering too much or watering too less because you don't know if your plants need water. The basic, the easiest way to know is by doing the finger test. Stick your finger under the soil about for about one inch or three centimeters around that and then see if it's moist. If it's not, then water. If it's too moist and wet, then stop watering for a couple of days. Number three, corn wine water is bad. And why? Or you can call it chlorinated water. Chlorinated water. Basically, chlorinated water is common in cities. So they just basically add the chlorine the chemical chlorine into the water as a disinfectant and that's good news because it helps clean the water of germs and bacteria but also it is also bad news for the eight living organisms in the plant in the plant soil because it kills it you can learn more about why how this affects sensitive plants like venus flytraps in the link above somewhere there preventing under Overwatering and to have it to have drainage holes. If you water too much, it might be a bit bad. Or underwatering, which is not covered here. So basically, you don't have if you like want caring for your plants like me and water all day long. Then the way to prevent this is to have drainage holes. Problems with overwatering will be covered here. Number five, if you water too much, your plants might have root rot or it's basically watering too much that makes the root rot. And also, there might be other diseases, so watch out for that. Alright, thanks for watching and subscribe and click the big notification bell and I will see you next time. But until then, good luck in the garden.